what's going on everybody welcome back to the channel man today we got another late night upload in a new series that is coming to the channel for the month of october it is called grind tober now what we'll be doing all october is we will be uploading a video every single day of october so nice little challenge for myself to keep the content rolling and to just keep pushing myself to new heights so if you guys got any suggestions on anything that you want to see now's the time to let it be known down in the comment section so today's video is for my new people that will end up getting the game it is october 2nd so you know the wave of new 2k players is right around the corner everybody is going to get it for black friday or christmas is right around the corner so i'm going to show you how to invite players to your mock court and you can do it in a couple different ways man you can play with ai players or you can play with your friends get some runs in with either your online friends or some ai players in the mock court if you don't want to just sit there and shoot around all day you got a couple different ways that you can lab up in the mock court so i'm gonna go ahead and meet y'all over at the mock court and i'm gonna show y'all exactly how to do it all right man so like i said it's for my newcomers if you don't know where the mock court is right here on the boulevard of the star is right here across from the proven grounds right here so go ahead and head on into your my court and of course if you're just somebody who doesn't touch the my court but you know what it can do and you weren't aware of how to invite your friends then this video will help you out also so of course in your my court you can change and decorate the themes on the walls and all that good stuff but right here in the bottom right you can see you want to press l1 and r1 to invite your players if you're on xbox it's probably lb rb so of course you got your ai players that you can invite right here at the top and then you have your entire friends list right here so you come down pick whatever friend you want to invite and boom you invite to my court it's that simple now going back up to the top if you want to utilize the ai players whatever team that you decide to play your my career with is who you can invite to my court and of course you can send invites to other players as well but let's just say for instance i want to invite Bron. i was gonna invite Bronny, but clearly he's not on the roster so we're gonna invite dalton connect and then we're going to invite let's say gabe vincent and then we're going to invite d'angelo russell and then let's just put Rui in the mix so we invited all of those guys to the mock court and as you can see they have appeared in the mock court and they are ready to get some runs in so of course you can hop straight onto your mock court and then you will have the option to pick exactly what you want to do when you hop on everybody that you invited to your mock court is going to hop on the court as well they will also start shooting around with you and everything like that and pass the ball to you so that's kind of helpful you know you got the ball machine so you don't have to chase the balls but but you also have your teammates there to pass it to you now of course you can click play and then you can pick what you want to do you can do 3v3 and of course you can assign your teams have me Brian, and just say gabe and then we're gonna put dalton d -Lo and Rui all on the same team and now you can run 3v3 right here in your my court man so if you want to try some different things out try some moves on an actual player instead of just you know labbing up moves in your my court by yourself and not actually have a defender on you you have the option to do this in the my court so you know you got plenty of different games and everything that you can run so aside from just doing 3v3 you can do one-on-one -on -one, two on two you can do best out of 10 you know work on your shooting you can do all around the world time three-point shooting and then you can do horse man so my court is really dope and then you can change the slider presets also to match whichever game mode you want to play if you play ranked pro m you can do that rec rank 3v3 but i would proceed with caution with this slider preset because it doesn't 100 match the latency that you see in these different areas man the best way to practice your jump shot in these different areas is to actually play in those areas because my court is technically an offline game mode so shooting will still feel different regardless of what slider preset you have it set to when you actually go out there online with other online players so a tip for this is go to the gatorade facility man go to the gatorade facility and then in the back are the gatorade courts which a lot of people don't play on too much but if you see that it's empty go hop on there and practice your jump shot because that's actually outside online where players can hop on and get some runs in so i would recommend practicing your jump shot that way or you can go into the pro-am shoot around do it that way and you can get a feel for both of those different environments so i hope the video was helpful for you man if it was be sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel down below as always be sure to stay safe out here and i told y'all it's grind tober man we uploading every single day in october so instead of catching y'all later i'm gonna catch y'all tomorrow man all right peace